Hey there. So this is supposed to be uh, more of a reminder for myself of how to do this, um, of how to crop several images at once. Um, it's not supposed to be a very thorough tutorial, so uh, I'm happy to, to answer any questions, but I don't know the, the, the tool I'm using is Image Magic, which I don't know myself very well, but I'm going to show you what I learned so far. So you download this, um, and you mainly use it in a command line. So, uh, yeah, you you open your command line and navigate to the um, to Image Magic, where for me it's in just a program files Image Magic. And now the the way I'm using it is, is very non professional. I know that, but I don't care. It works for me. Um, so I just copy all the images I want to have cropped into the um, into the image magic file uh, folder and um, I need to administer that okay that's fine and now I use the following command um, that's margrify that's one of those uh, commands in here I'm not sure I think margrify is that you overwrite the the files, I'm not quite sure what's the difference to convert, for example. I don't know. I don't care. Um, and then, yeah, dash crop. And then you're going to uh, put the final image resolution in there. So um, what I did, I cropped it once by hand, one of the images, and then looked what the, what the, just what the size of the image is. So the original is 1920 by 1080 but I know it's going to have this resolution in the end. And then um, those two numbers, uh, that's the offset um, from the top left corner. So what I just did is I knew I cropped like the lower center part of the image. That's what I want. So I just um, subtracted uh, 1294 from 1920. So I have like what stays over here and then um, divided that by two so I get this offset and um, then I just took the the difference between 1080 and 976 which is this offset so we end up with uh, 313 and 104 um, and then you're just gonna be careful it's gonna override all the images so be sure like in here there are no other images which is good be sure you have the correct uh, file ending png or jpeg and um this the asterisk asterisk is just saying um it's just a placeholder for whatever and um so we're gonna hit enter and now we can see if we put make this large uh we should see something happening there's no error message. Um, hold on, let me refresh that. Nothing is happening, right? Did I do a mistake? Uh, okay. Hold on. Let me escape that and try that again. Wait. Now I only cropped one. So let's... Ah, now it's working. Yeah, now you can see it's going through all the images step by step. And I think, yeah, like this and probably 1.2 is probably damaged now. Okay, yeah, because I cropped it already once, but okay just use the asterisk and don't do it twice because then it just keeps just keeps copying but we can see um first of all it is it is gonna take a while so it needs maybe one or two seconds per image but then in the end we have the cropped image and yeah that's all i know about it uh i probably can't help you with any problems <laughs> uh google it uh the yeah i i put the the link of the tool in the description but that's pretty much it good luck with that and have a nice day and future me good luck with figuring it out again <laughs>